Hi, and welcome to an all-new episode of Coffee with America. I'm Sasha Rionda. Obesity is one of the top health threats pets face, with a recent survey showing around 60% of dogs and cats are overweight or obese. As veterinarians, doctors Bernard Hodges and Terence Ferguson, who were recently nominated for an NAACP award, are here to help by teaming up with Hills Pet Nutrition to help dogs and cats achieve and maintain a healthy weight. You may also recognize them as the co-stars of Critter Fixer's Country Vets on Nat Geo. Thank you to both of you for joining us. Thank you for, having, for having us. Okay, so tell us a bit about this concerning trend in pet health. It definitely is a concerning trend. Pet obesity is a growing epidemic. You know, a big factor though is awareness. Oftentimes, pet parents don't realize that their babies are a little bit obese. So that's why we're super excited to team up with Heals Pet Nutrition for the end pet obesity campaign because even those little bit of, of extra weight can make a big difference. Wow, and what does obesity mean for a pet? You know, we know that obesity is one of the top health concerns in our babies and, and pets. And we know that just one extra pound, it may not sound like a lot, but it can definitely be, um, you know, life threatening sometimes. Dr. Hodge and I get animals in every day that we run blood work and they're not feeling well and they have different diseases like diabetes and we directly attribute that to, to the weight gain they have, whether they're obese or whether they're overweight, which is why it's so important for us to be proactive in our weight management. Very helpful. And how can pet parents tell if their pet is overweight? You know, one of the beauties of the campaign that we have with Heels is they have different tools that help us as veterinarians, but also help um, pet owners at home to try to determine if their babies are good weight, if they're a little bit overweight, or if they're obese. And one of those tests they have is called the love test, L-O-V-E. And the L means that we want to locate those ribs. You know, we don't want to visually be able to see them, but we do want to be able to feel them without having to press very hard on the sides of the, of, of the abdomen, um, of the thorax. And we also, the O means observe. We want to stand over our babies, look from the top, and see if we can see that nice little waist. You know, hopefully we can see that. But if not, sometimes they're straight. We want to make sure we, we have that. The V is we want to visualize from the side. We're looking from the side to try to determine what we look like. What's the confirmation? Do we have a little waist? Are we kind of hanging a little bit, you know, like some of our cats are? And the E is we want to evaluate our diet. We want to be sure that um, how we're feeding. Do we feed once a day? Are we feeding twice a day? How much we're feeding? Then we want to gather these results and we want to put them into the tool that Heels has. And between that tool and the veterinarian, we can come up with a plan and a diet that's specially formulated for your baby. Good to know. Now, is it difficult to manage a pet's weight loss? You know, I know our fur babies look at us and they're kind of looking at us with those bright eyes, want, you know, some extra food and I get it. But, you know, and we think about, man, we want to make sure they're satiated and full. But really, it doesn't have to be intimidating, you know. Just kind of come up with your with a plan with your veterinarian. You know, that's why we as veterinarians just want to spread the word that, uh, you know, these simple tools and steps you can take using the, the end pet obesity campaign, you know, it can be really easy. That's good advice. So what are your top tips for pet weight loss and maintenance? You know, one, we want to make sure our babies are active. That's the first thing. Um, the next thing, if you think your baby is overweight, you want to consult with your veterinarian because we know that one of the most important um, decisions that owners have to make is what do we feed our babies? And, you know, Dr. Hodge and I, for pets that are overweight, we often recommend Hills Science Diet Perfect Weight Nutrition because we know on that diet more than 70% uh, of pets lose weight within the first 10 weeks. And for those babies that are obese, we recommend um, Heels Prescription Diet. But definitely get with your veterinarian to come up with a, the correct diet so that your baby can stay healthy for a long time. Okay, sounds good. Where can we go to learn more? You can visit inpetobesity.com. You know, you can learn more about, you know, these tools that we talked about, you know, and you can access free tools to keep your pet, you know, non-obese as well as healthy. Oh, I'm sure many pet parents are going to appreciate all this information. Doctors, thank you so much. Thanks for having us.